The Smalls are isolated reefs in the middle of St George's Channel, 20 miles off the coast of Pembrokeshire and part of the Pembrokeshire Marine Special Area of Conservation. This site is very exposed to both tidal currents and strong wave action. Nevertheless, these reefs are home to an amazing variety of marine plants and animals. The largest of the small's inhabitants are seals. Safely away from human disturbance, the shallow reefs attract a good supply of fresh fish and the immersed rocks provide a place to haul out and rest. The rugged rocky seabed is dissected into a series of cliffs and gullies through which the strong tidal currents run and only the toughest marine life can survive. Delicate species like jewel anemones are small and low lying and keep out of the way of the currents. A strong attachment is essential and dead man's fingers carpet the cliff faces feeding on plankton carried along by the currents. Kelp forest crowns the reef tops and billows gracefully in the ever-present current. On the seabed below the kelp, a mat of red seaweed covers the rocks. These algae appear fragile and delicate, but really they are very tough. Kelp forests supply a refuge for fish, such as shells of pollock, which are a ready food supply for seals. Monitoring the marine life in a place as remote as the smalls is difficult and can only be done in exceptionally calm weather during slack water of neap tides. Even then, the dive team has only an hour or so when conditions are suitable for work. The first job is to mark the site. This is done by drilling holes into the rock, which can be a difficult job when the rock is as hard as that found at the smalls. On the smalls, two depth zones were studied on a rocky cliff, one at the top where there is a mixture of algae and animals, and the second at the base, which is entirely animal dominated. After drilling, Bolts are hammered into the rock and marked with fluorescent tape for ready relocation. Once fixed to the rock, a frame holding four gridded quadrats is suspended on bolts and the divers count and record all the species found. Each quadrat is divided into 25 squares and so each species has a potential score of 25. This seal showed a keen interest in what was going on and was intent on giving this diver a helping hand. The Smalls is an isolated place, out of sight and out of mind, to all but mariners who need to keep well clear of the dangerous rocks. However, it is important that we understand what lives in remote places like this, and how the marine life changes over time so we can monitor the health of our seas.